Welcome back everyone, my name is Echo. Today we have been given build four for the Minecraft Pocket Edition slash Windows 10 Edition 1.2 beta. Before we dive into this video, what was changed, what was bug fixed, a lot of you are asking me saying, hey Echo, where is the Xbox One beta? Like you, I am waiting for it. Now today is Thursday, the 10th of August, 2017. If the beta doesn't drop today, personally, I don't think the Xbox beta is coming until next week. Now, going back to yesterday, Helen Angel, our community manager, left this comment on the Discord saying, maybe today, if they can fix the last few beta blocking bugs. So apparently, the Xbox beta is having a lot of technical difficulties. So, guys, I will keep you updated. I will make a video because, like all of you, I want to check it out as an Xbox Minecraft player. I want to see how it plays. Also, focusing on a negative in this build, over the past one or two days, I have brought you tutorials on how to get custom capes on your own Minecraft skin. In this build, Mojang have removed it. Now, everybody wants custom capes or even a cape on their own Minecraft skin. Why on earth they keep removing this, I really don't know. Only because a select few of us do have access to the Mojang skin pack, which is the, the Minecon skin pack, Minecon 2016, blah, 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 blah. No one wants to be using Alex. Nobody wants to be using Steve. Everybody wants to use their own skin with a cape. So that's sadly been removed. Anyway, another change that has happened is if I go to store, you'll also notice if Something you've purchased on the store itself has an update, for example, Pure BD Craft. It will actually tell you that there's an update for it now. It'll have like a, an exclamation mark and a little bit of an icon. I'm not going to be doing that right now. So, the official changes are right here. Minecraft Win 10 slash Android Beta 1.2 Build 4 tweaks. Clicking the left thumbstick on a controller will now switch focus between recipe book and inventory. Added item animations to the recipe book to show which items are being used for crafting. Default controller sensitivity has been increased to 60. Also, you can see a whole range of changes. You're talking like another 50, 60 changes that have been fixed. Apparently, the custom skins still isn't fixed. You still end up with like a black screen. But if you notice any more bugs that haven't been fixed, go and report it on bugs.mojang.com. I will leave the full change list in description. In case you guys want to go and check it out. Also, somebody else noticed in game that we now have like 3D animated heads. So you guys can, like you know, previously for Minecraft Pocket Edition, heads in the crafting or in the creator menu, they weren't really 3D. So as you can see them there in the creator menu, they're looking kind of 3D styled. You can also see in the hotbar as well. So you'll notice here that... I mean, of course, they already look like that when you place them anyway, but you can see them in my hotbar. Slight changes, minor changes, everything else is just, well, we're still waiting, guys. And something else I do want to focus on is that, personally, I feel that this whole entire menu in survival should be optional to be able to be turned on or off. I feel like if you're a PC crafter, you're the classic crafting, everyone's kind of making a quick a quick switch because all you have to do is tap on a, an item and it will instantly make it and put it in your hotbar. Very good for the likes of iOS and Android users, not so great for the Windows 10 users or Xbox users. So little changes, that's the update. I will keep you all updated on the Xbox beta. Take care, stay beautiful, have a great day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye!